Onshape's wrap feature just got even more powerful. You can now wrap sketches onto cones or conical faces. Simply select the wrap tool, choose a sketch, and apply it directly to a conical face. Perfect for adding text, logos, and other features. Here, we've wrapped text onto the conical face of the seal retainer, demonstrating precise placement and a seamless fit on the curved shape. Onshape's Reference Repair Manager just got even better. You can now fix broken references directly from a failed feature without navigating to versions and history. Simply right click on the failed feature and choose Edit Healthy Moment. The new repair panel opens, showing a side by side view of your model and its last healthy state. As you update the broken reference, both views stay synchronized, making it easy to pinpoint and fix issues. No more hunting through history, just click, repair, and move on. With this update, you can now copy and paste configuration inputs. To do this, expand the configuration panel and choose the input you want to copy. You also have the option to copy all inputs at once. Then go to the Part Studio or Assembly where you want to paste the configuration inputs and you will see the option to paste inputs. When possible, the inputs will maintain internal IDs and visibility conditions. In the last update, we introduced form features for sheet metal in Onshape. These form features not only create the form in the folded model, but they also show the formed features as simple sketches in the sheet metal flat view. With this update, you can now hide those sketches in the sheet metal flat view by clicking the hide icon in the feature list. With this update, you will find two new drawing properties available under Dimensions. The first is the option to break dimensions by default. Like the name implies, this option gives you control over the default break behavior in the drawing. The second is the option Show Dimension Lines by Default. These options allow you to specify which behavior you would like by default and save you from defining them at the individual dimension level. Onshape Render Studio now supports OpenVDB volume appearances, allowing you to create realistic volumetric effects like smoke, fog, and water. Using OpenVDB, you can apply a volumetric appearance to a simple cube or any enclosed shape, defining density, scattering, and absorption properties to achieve lifelike results. This allows you to simulate real-world elements like smoke, mist, and liquid volumes without modeling complex geometry. Simply insert a volume model, assign the OpenVDB appearance, and fine-tune its properties. With this update, improvements have been made to Lambda functions in FeatureScript. In this example, we are defining a mapped array of locations, and in the past, the syntax required defining a function, keyword, and the return block. Now, this can be constructed using a simpler lambda function represented with the equal arrow. This makes the code more concise and easier to read. Thanks for watching. Click the logo to subscribe or see some of our other videos linked here.